Dear learners, I am Ahmed Noman Sadek. Today I would like to draw a very important topographical exam question route which is actually starting from Lady Smith Road and it is ending at Nelson Road. But today I would like to draw this route very quickly and without much explanation. And here is topographical exam screen. And this is a question window on which the starting point and ending point is clearly mentioned. Also, there are some instructions to draw a topographical route. So, please read the question carefully before start drawing your topographical route. And this is a small screen on which all the question numbers are written. You could jump to any question you want to solve just by pressing the question number on it. And if you want to go to next or previous question, you could use these buttons. And at the end, if you want to review your assessment, you could press this button here. And these are the main buttons to draw a topographical route. And for the detailed functionality of these buttons, I have an other video which is available on my channel. And this is actual topographical interactive screen on which start button which is always start uh, marker which is always green marker is mentioned and drawn and the end marker which is always written also drawn here. So here the green marker is at Lady Smith Road and the end marker is at Nelson Road. Now I will zoom in this interactive topographical screen and would like to draw the route from green to red marker. So here we go. This is topographical interactive screen. I can zoom in or zoom out. So this is starting point and it is at Lady Smith Road and about the red marker which is the end marker is here and it is at Nelson Road. So first you need to plan your route. I have already planned your uh, this route actually. So I will like to draw this route very quickly. When I am planning this route, I will zoom out so that I could see the start and end point. But when I will draw the route, I will zoom in so that I would see the route very quickly like this. So my planning is to use these roads and I will try to enter here and then I will ultimately be able to reach at the red marker. But here see if this is the green marker, there is no way to enter here on this road or on around this roundabout. So the only way to reach here or the best way to reach here is I will use this road here and this from here I will be able to enter on this A road. And when I will reach here, I have to go underneath because this road is at the top. Then when I will reach here, I would not be able to go here because I am here underneath. So then I will have to use this roundabout and ultimately I will use these roads and I will reach here on this road and at the top I will use this uh, flyover and ultimately I will be able to reach here at this roundabout and from here my end point is here on this side. So here the road is closed but I am on this side so I have to reach here and ultimately I would be able to reach at this point. But if the end point is here then I have to follow and adopt the different way. I will do that at the end as well. Now let's start from the beginning that is at the green marker. So here is the green marker. I am just starting. I am and I will always keep my route towards the left hand side of the road. So always zoom in when you are drawing, especially when you are at the small or side roads. So here we go. I will go like this and here I am keeping myself or my route at the left side of the road like this. Then simply I will continue like this. Here at the left hand side when I will reach here. Now I am trying to join the A road which is here 
which is clearly you can see this is a road now i will continue from here like this i will simply start from the same point like this like this when i will reach here i will make it down i will move the screen down like this and now from here i have i have told you earlier that now i am going underneath and there is no way to go in this direction so i have to go and follow along i have to keep my route along the left hand side of this roundabout so i will keep like this like this like this i am keeping my route towards the left hand side of this roundabout now i am here now i will make it smaller that is i am zooming out this then i will go like this here 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 i will go like this like this like this and from here i will move and follow this road i will go along this road in this way and just draw the route and here i am simply going here when i was coming from south i was underneath but now i am at the top so always remember these points so here you can go like this this is not a problem you can simply cross this when i will reach here this is also a flyover i will follow this because if i zoom out so this is my end point so i have to go like this and from here i will be able to go and reach at my end point so here you go i will simply come like this and i am now at the flyover at the top of the flyover i am still keeping myself towards the left hand side of the road like this then again i will go like this now i am on the north circular road so no problem at all just continue your route like this this is also not a problem you can simply i have explained in my other videos why this is not a problem so now i am just drawing the route so i will take this slip and i will try to reach at this roundabout so i will take this slip road here not a problem here 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 again i will reach at the roundabout when i will reach here then i will again see the end point here is the end point and this is a closed road but it is on the left side so i have a route here and simply come like this and would be able to reach at the end point so i will simply take left here so i will turn left here and go like this now again this is the route so again i will simply i will undo a little bit but because i want to keep myself towards the left hand side of the road again i will make it bigger that is zoom in and i will turn right like this and then here this is the end point and it is very clear i will go like this like this like this like this and at the end i will go and touch at the end point so here i have completed the route and always remember when you have completed the route always check your route up, uh, 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 regarding the left hand side of the road because sometime people keep their route at some places towards the right hand side which is a mistake so you would be losing the marks in that case so always keep your left keep your route towards the left hand side of the road now i will just let you know if your end point is here at this point now suppose your end point is here instead of here so always remember that in exam there is only one end point but here just i am explaining suppose this is a different end point and instead of reaching here if you have to reach at this point then how would you go if you come directly here you will be getting zero marks because this is a closed road in that case there is actually no way here to reach here so if you go and turn left here then there is no way or there is no route to reach at this point in that case what you need to do is you will come here and you will follow this route and if you come here you would not be able to go on the yellow road so in that case you would be able to go and follow this street and then you will be able to join this yellow which is b road and then 
from here at somewhere here here you would be able to reach at this point so let's draw but be careful this is one way this is also one way this is one way this is one way so i could use either this or this to reach at this point so i will just start my route from this point so in that case i will be able to go from here the reason i have told you i can't continue from here because if i continue here this yellow is at the top you would not be able to join this yellow yellow is the top at the top that is b road is at the top and a road is going underneath so i will have to go and take this side road which is street so i have to go like this like this like this when i will reach here then i will see again where to go so actually i have to join the yellow road which is actually the b road so i will go like this but when i will reach here be careful don't ignore this roundabout you have to make a clear cut curve here so that tfl could see that you have seen the roundabout here so make a round proper round here and then join the this b road like this like this which is the yellow road now i will go straight up like this here you go here i am keeping myself and i can't go here because this is one way so here i could go from here but better to come from this side i could also come from this because this one way is starting from here and it is ending here again i am telling you that you could either go from here or you could go from here but you would not be able to go from here because this is one way so i will go like this simply here and again when i am turning left even this is one way i could keep left hand side of the road so i will go like this and i am not going opposite to the one way because one way is starting from this point i am away from here so don't worry about it so when you are here again there are two ways you can go here and then come here or you could go like this and ultimately you would be able to reach at this point so i would like to follow this road so i will go like this like this like this okay then i will go like this here here you go here here and you could reach here but you could also go from here so no worries at all you could also follow this route so here it is a little bit smaller so i will suggest to follow this but if there is a difference of only a few feet uh, then it doesn't make any difference regarding marks and now i have completed the route but remember when you have completed the route always press stop drawing button here i will simply delete the extra route which i have drawn or extra line which i have drawn that were just to show you how you could draw the other route if i change the end point so here you go i will simply press stop drawing button and the same button now has become start drawing button again now if you want to make any change you can again press start drawing button and the same button will become stop drawing button and you can make any change but at the end please press stop drawing button for one second i will show you the animation so there was this was the screen and first of all you when you start drawing your route you have to press this start drawing button when you press this the same button will become stop drawing button and then you would be able to draw your route from green to red marker here is the green marker is at lady smith road and the end marker is at nelson road and here i have completed the route when i have completed the route the i have to press this stop drawing button again like this so i will press stop drawing button and the same button now again become start drawing button so that's the end of today's presentation thank you very much